Hello and welcome to today's video on honeybees. So please watch the complete video. And if you are new to this channel then subscribe to my channel for upcoming videos. Let's start today's video. Honeybees are well known for the honey they produce. Honey is a naturally sweet, viscous fluid that is produced by bees using nectar from flowers. Honey bees are an essential part of our ecosystem as they play a critical role in pollinating crops and flowers. Honey bees also play a significant role in producing honey, which is a food source for humans and other animals. In this video, we will take a detailed look at how honey bees make honey, the process of converting nectar into honey, and the different types of honey produced by honey bees. The process of collecting nectar. The first step in making honey is collecting nectar. Honey bees collect nectar from flowers using their long, tube like tongues called proboscis. When a honey bee finds a flower that has nectar, it lands on the flower and uses its proboscis to suck the nectar out of the flower. The nectar is stored in the bee's honey stomach which is separate from its digestive stomach. Honey bees have a special enzyme in their honey stomach called invertase. Invertase breaks down the complex sugars in the nectar into simple sugars that the bees can digest. While the bee is collecting nectar, it adds enzymes from its salivary glands to the nectar. These enzymes help to break down the nectar further and prevent it from fermenting. The process of converting nectar into honey. Once the honey bee has collected enough nectar, it returns to the hive. The honey bee regurgitates the nectar into the mouth of another bee, which adds more enzymes to the nectar. The bees pass the nectar from bee to bee until it reaches the last bee in the chain. The last bee in the chain places the nectar into a cell in the honeycomb. The honeycomb is made up of hexagonal cells that are made of beeswax. Beeswax is produced by the bees from glands on their abdomen. The bees then fan their wings over the nectar to evaporate the water from it. The bees continue to fan their wings until the nectar has a water content of around 17%. Once the water content of the nectar has been reduced to 17%, the bees seal the cell with wax. The reduced water content of the nectar is critical to the honey making process. Because it prevents the honey from fermenting. Honey is a highly concentrated sugar solution, and if the water content is too high, it can ferment, which can lead to spoilage. The different types of honey produced by honeybees. Honeybees produce different types of honey depending on the type of nectar they collect. Some common types of honey produced by honeybees include wildflower honey. This honey is produced by honeybees that collect nectar from a variety of different wildflowers. Clover honey. This honey is produced by honey bees that collect nectar from clover flowers. Orange blossom honey. This honey is produced by honey bees that collect nectar from orange blossoms. Manuka honey. This honey is produced by honey bees that collect nectar from the manuka tree, which is native to New Zealand. Conclusion. In conclusion, Honey bees play a critical role in the production of honey. The process of making honey starts with collecting nectar from flowers using their long, tube-like tongues called proboscis. Once the nectar has been collected, the bees add enzymes to the nectar to break it down further. The bees then store the nectar in hexagonal cells made of beeswax and fan their wings over the nectar to evaporate the water from it. Hope so now you will understand how honey bees make honey. If you want to watch a playlist on ants evolution you can press the above card. Thanks for watching my content. If you like my content press the like button. Moreover, 
You can support me by sending some BUSD detailed in the video description. And subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. Thank you goodbye.